Hallo, ich war hier in Zürich. Hi, ich bin, bin. Bin von Min Kobayashi. There you go. Yay. Yeah, and finally. <laughs> it is a Japanese name. I was told that I didn't pronounce it when I chose it as a pseudonym. So, <laughs> at the opera. And, yeah, this will be my, my first ever club video on this channel. That's because I don't know a lot of booktubers, but now I'm finally here with at least one. <laughs> well, you, you just traveled across the continent to visit yeah. me, so <laughs> it works. Because yeah. we are in Canada. Yay! Yeah. <laughs> and a video on mention on men's channel as well. Also, I will link that down below, but here we will do the Rip It or Ship It book tag. And for everyone who doesn't know how it works, you basically pick two characters and then you say if you ship them or if you ship them. <laughs> so we got Bella Swan and Jughead Jones. <laughs> no, uh, I... Okay, I have never watched Twilight, so I can't tell yeah, you that I, one. I read the books and watched the movie and... I like Jughead. Um... Yeah, yeah. I, I feel I like, like Jughead's her. not her type. No. Or she, he's not her type. You know. No. You're supposed to disagree no. with me. Okay, we have... Yeah, the, yeah, that's the reason because I like Jughead, but I don't like Bella very much. So... I feel like I would have to get to know her first. Grover Underwood, which I don't plan on doing. <laughs> don't plan on getting to know Bella. Grover Underwood and... Shazzy from, mm. uh, oh, Grover Underwood is from Percy Jackson, and Shazzy is the main character in The mm. Wrath and the Dawn. Cool. There's many elements to this. First of all, they are totally different people. Like, mm -hmm. Grover is this, like, shy, quirky, blah, 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 yeah. and she's this, like, princess from this Arab and Arab, yes. Arabic <laughs> mythology. Yes. But, um. like, I feel like she loves nature and storytelling, mm. and she's adventurous, and so is he. Yeah. There, there could be some things. Yes. You at, disagree. At least, at least some. some I'm going to say that they there. could be a good yes. couple. Not necessarily, um, not so, not, not necessarily the best couple, but they, they would go on a few dates. Yes. Yes. So, so maybe it wouldn't be a long-term relationship, but at least. That they... Not a ride or die. Did I use that terminology right? I don't know. I am in in English is not my first English. So. I don't know slang. <laughs> we have Harry Potter. Yeah. And oh, you can choose the other one. That would have been a smart way to do it. Hmm. In no, no. In Elijah, Elijah, my cousin. <laughs> no, I don't think so. Well, imagine Harry is an adult. Yes. They're both pretentious. British men <laughs> who are very straight. However, in a weird fandom which combines vampire diaries yes, and with the Harry thing, Potter. Harry Potter, would they have a torrid love affair? Yeah, I can't. I can't. I was trying to be controversial, but I can't argue it. <laughs> oh, Damon Avatar from Vampire Diaries? My guilty crush. And... Caroline Forbes! <laughs> Darn it! So, there might be some... Okay, I, I like both of them. They both start oh. as these very unlikable people. Mm. However, over the course of the time, they both become wonderful human beings and redeem redemption. And it's funny because in the first episode, this isn't spoiler because it's the first episode. They sleep together. That's true. I forgot they, about that. They literally are the first romantic relationship yes. on the show. Yeah. However, it's not romantic because he's compulsing her. Well, he's, she's attracted to him. It, it, yeah. It's confusing. Yes. It's David's no. worst offense in the entire show, I would say. Yeah. But later on, they redeem it and he apologizes and there's this whole thing and they have like this brother-sister relationship. <laughs> Um, yeah. For no apparent reason, um, and I, I think that they would not be a romantic couple because of that. Yeah, I. It's funny because they actually are canon romantic. Yeah. I, well, kinda, not really. 
I've got Caleb Rivers from Pretty Little Liars. I'm pretty sure we're all at TV shows. <laughs> I got Hazel Grace Links. Lancaster. Yeah. I'm gonna go with a no. What are you going to do it with? Something more weird level I feel it could maybe work. Are you gonna say? <laughs> well, what is your reasons? Since you can't even remember who Caleb is. <laughs> it's okay. I don't know. He has blonde hair. Yeah. He's slightly pretentious. He's a good boyfriend. He's he's the best boyfriend. Um I don't know. I'm gonna say a solid I was I'm saying no and now I'm saying yes. Um <laughs> I'm gonna say a yes. Yeah. I wanna see Caleb support her in cancer. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. You're just agreeing with me. It is no fun. Hey, 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 I first disagree and then, and then you change. I am a persuasive human being. <laughs> Stephen Salvador. And Emily Fields. Well, I haven't read the books, but in the book she is bisexual, so this could work. I. Okay. These are both characters which. I started off liking, mm -hmm. and as the show progressed, like less and less and less. The issue yeah. I have with yeah. Stefan... Well, well, that's true for me for Stefan as well, but with me, I don't know, I guess. I uh, liked her on and off. Yeah, it did depend on the thing. Like, there was times when I, like, really loved Emily, like, but... She's definitely not my favorite. No. I think she would be a good liar to come alongside him yes. and they can lie about being vampires yes. and take over the world because she's got skills. She's yes. she knows how to deal with murderers. Yes. That's, a, that's a good skill to date a vampire. Yes. <laughs> that's a great skill. Yes. I, I'm going to say a yes. Mm. James Watson from Sherlock or um. the books. Rebecca Michelson. Oh, Sorry. My writing is terrible. That's why I read it. <laughs> I wish you'd watched the originals. I can't comment on it. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah. I don't really yeah. like uh, Rebecca. I like Rebecca better in the originals, but Rebecca uh -huh. is not worthy of James Watson. No. <laughs> no. Do you like, you don't like Rebecca either? Uh, in Vampire Diaries, not really. Um, Betty Cooper from Riverdale. And Khalid, Khalid. from, uh, it just says Wrath and Dawn. Yeah. W and D. Um. <laughs> girl from Contemporary Mystery Murder and Boy King Who Murders People. Yeah. <laughs> that sounds like a great relationship. Yeah. Um. I'm gonna, I'm gonna rip this one hard. Do you have any ju justify this relationship for me? What would what would bring Betty and Khalid together? No, you can't no. find any reason to justify this couple. No. Okay. Oh, we have to rip them over here. Yeah. We only have three couples so far. <laughs> so. Um, who is your person? Oh, Edward Cullen. Edward Cullen and Prince Kai. Oh my. God. I, I'll give you the easy one. Justify why they shouldn't date, and I'll justify why they should. Um. Why should a vampire and a futuristic uh. prince of... Oh, you don't know who Kai is very much, do you? No. He's okay. a futuristic, kind-hearted man <laughs> who rules the thing, <laughs> and one of my forever crushes. It's yeah. not an issue. Um, oh. I would say they shouldn't date because um, they have very different interests. And also, um, I don't know that much about Edward. Edward is creepy and compares himself to a lion. I deserves everything in the world. He is, he is lovely and wonderful and intelligent and smart and he's Asian and really Okay. I'm not into Kai at all. Um, he's too young for me now. I, I think he might be 18, so it will be like... Um... And then I'm going to argue yeah. why they should be a couple, because their lives are both, um, screwed up and they would yeah. relate that. That's about it. <laughs> so are we, are we really yes. a couple? Yes. Yes. Okay. 
Hermione. Hermione is someone I really know. And Jacob Black. We're not sure if his name is actually Black. I thought yes. it was Blackburn. Yeah, yes, but I thought it was just Black. And she read the books and watched the movies, so, so. she's probably the <laughs> better expert. But no guarantee. <laughs> I don't think I know anything about Jacob Black other than he takes his shirt off and he's, um... A man boy. Taylor Lautner. <laughs> this, this is what I know about him. Well, yeah, he's a whale wolf, but he's like... And everyone's like, oh. <laughs> that, that's yeah. all I know. I could not tell you anything about his personality. Does he have a personality? Uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> I can't just say. I would say if it takes that long, he does not have a personality. <laughs> um, I would just say that um, I, I, I she be. needs a smart, intelligent, yeah, wise yeah, man. Yeah. Jacob, Jacob is not that man. Yeah. Although, I feel like this might be like a crumb situation, where she'd go on a date with him because he would listen mm. to her read, yeah. but then she'd be like, no, and get rid of him. Yes. <laughs> so. We're ripping it. But at the end of the day, I don't know how you close your videos. Yes, I don't even know it <laughs> Why do outros have to be a thing? No one knows the heck what to do with them. It's so weird. But... Don't forget to be awesome. I'm just gonna quote John Green. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so, I hope you enjoyed this video and yeah, don't forget to check out Min's video on her channel. We're talking about love triangles over there, it's super yeah. fun. <laughs> yeah, and then I will see you in the next video. Bye!